Thanks for taking the time to watch Yukon Tech Tips. Today we're going to be showing you how to use our Yukon axle bearing puller tool for Toyotas on this 88 Forerunner back here. We're also going to show you how to properly measure and cut our Yukon Chromoly cut to fit axles for this Toyota. Stay with us, we'll walk you right through it. So after you've removed the inner snap ring, go ahead and attach your Yukon axle bearing puller tool to the back side of the axle assembly using the four bolts. Tighten it down evenly and then put the entire assembly in your press. Use the press slowly to start out until you get the axle shaft pushed all the way through the assembly. Once you've removed the Yukon axle bearing puller tool from your axle shaft, you can then slide off the brake assembly and the backing plate as a unit. Now we can get to measuring our axle shaft. With your original axle shaft, measure from the outside face of the flange down to the physical end of the axle shaft and note the measurement. With the reference point from the original measurement, mark your new axle shaft on the splines with a permanent marker that you can easily see. Now with the chop saw or band saw or any sturdy metal cutting blade, cut along the line that's been marked on the axle shaft and make sure that it's square. After you've made the cut, take a die grinder or an angle grinder and bevel the edge of the spline teeth, making it easier for installation. Hey, thanks again for watching this Yukon Tech Tip on how to properly use the Yukon Toyota Axle Bearing Puller Tool and how to also properly measure and cut your Chromoly cut to fit axles. If you have any questions on this subject or any other tech questions, please give us a call at 800-330-2206.